thank you so much, uh, Mr. President, and Vice President, and uh, colleagues. It's uh, been a great day uh, to listen to you all, and many wise things have been said. Today we have discussed our past, we have discussed our present situation, and we have discussed our future that we know little about. But we are all determined that we are going to do everything to secure the future for our citizens. And I'm very happy to hear about the consensus and the determination to tackle these challenges that we have in Europe. As Mr. Kieran said, uh, we have a map, and this work program is a map and also toolkit. But I would like to add something to that picture of the map and the toolkit. And that is the importance for us as politicians in the Committee of Regions to make sure that this map that is going to be read by different people, that we are uh, in consensus of where we are going. And here we have to collaborate, collaborate with all the multi-level, but also with the private sector and the, corp the, the companies that we have in Europe. And to the map is going to be read by people and also the tools are going to be read by people. So here it's very important that we uh, make sure that democracy works. This uh, crisis has taught us many lessons. And uh, I think that in the work to rebuild Europe, we need really uh, to speed up all the things that we have been working on for years with the Green Deal or the digitalization and other things. The time has come now, and I think uh, listening to you all today, I feel uh, positive about the future. And uh, I think also that we have to discuss more uh, about the democratic, democratic challenges because the consequences uh, are going to be uh, bad if we don't do that. So I want to thank you all for a very interesting day today. And this work program is really a map and a toolkit in this work. Thank you.